I feel like I can help get these girls what they deserve. We'll see some new things at Formation this year. I feel like I've come into this event in a completely different place than I was last year. The terrain's different, it's hot, it's probably windy, it's rough days, like you work hard. I want Formation to be the gateway to Rampage. <gasps>I came up with a plan earlier in the spring. Yeah, I thought it would be really fun to get a bunch of girls together and ride before formation and then do a road trip down to the desert. In the plan we have obviously Brett's yard here, just focusing on tricks and jumps and drops and all kinds of stuff that, you know, is really applicable to the formation zone. And then after this, we'll head up to Farwell Canyon for some serious free ride lines. Yeah, so me and Casey did a bit of riding in New Zealand this summer together as well. So we've been kind of like on the same page. Casey let me come stay here at Brett's house. It's like the ultimate training ground. This place is unbelievable. Yeah, Robin Gooms is the first woman that landed a backflip in contest. Yeah, I didn't go to Crankworx to claim a first backy or anything like that. <laughs> it was huge for me, like it's, I'm so grateful for it. Robin's just a charger, absolute warrior on the bike. Uh, really good person to be around and like just feed off of. This is what I wait for. Tammy, good vibes, good human being, sick rider. Last year's invite for formation pretty much like fully changed the trajectory of my career. It was pretty amazing. Yeah, we got the email a month a bit ago. Like first you, you get excited for yourself and then you look at the list and you get stoked because you see all the other girls on there. Yeah. What I need to do. Like, just pull harder. Loop out. Like, try to like, loop, loop out. And never let go, Jess. Yeah. Never let go. Never let go. Jess, keep on going. Keep on going. And look for the landing backwards. Like, don't rip it back and then stop. Once you're, like, upside down. Uh-huh. Once you're here, keep, 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 keep spotting backwards. Oh, my God. That was better, Cammy. That was way better. You should try a backflip suit. No, I don't know how to do anything but a backflip. It terrified me. Yeah, so instead of pre-lining like that, you're yeah, pre like that. that. <laughs> <laughs> into it and then follow the ramp up. Yeah. We're gonna go get supplies for our trip up to Farwell Canyon. We'll be spending a couple nights out in the wilderness. Sleeping bags, a mat to sleep on, and um, we'll buy like a tent for, for, for like four people. This is the gold mining section. Chalky in? Yeah. I'm on fire. I didn't even chalk it. It looks like there's a trail up the ridge line. I don't know, maybe just go straight up. We're just scoping some lines. We're at a campsite that's like right across from the Hoodoos, so we get to just kind of 
check it out firsthand. Our plan this morning is to just traverse this little slope and we're just gonna ride some of these lower little scree type slasher lines. Pretty exciting. It looks pretty fun. It's just like hard to tell until you get like up there. This is not easy. Yeah, girl. Like that, that, that dirt's like chocolate cake. These lines take about like 45 minutes to hike up each one, so it's quite taxing. Watching Brett drop in, he had so much confidence riding down that ridge line. I almost crashed right away, actually, right at the top because I dug in and kind of went sideways too hard. <laughs> anyone makes it to the bottom of that run or any of these runs it's just like so exciting whether you crashed or you had like some moments or whatever it's just like you made it down and so hyped and like it's always a celebration at the bottom it's sick the ridge line on the top is like super narrow so you're just like exposed maybe went in too hot there and just fall over the bars scorpion You're lucky when you come away unscathed. I was like, I can't see. I don't know if I can breathe right now. <laughs> this, I think this is like the perfect training grounds for formation. This is probably as close as it could get. Really looking forward to the whole road trip down to the Dez and being in the Dez. Bring it. The terrain was deeper and it was super soft. And it was my first time riding something like this. It was pretty fun, yeah, something really unique. Seeing the girls ride all this stuff, it's insane. I can't wait to see like where they take all these skills when they get to the desert in Utah and, and ride at formation. It's, it's gonna be like insane to watch. So yeah, tune in. <laughs> <laughs>